Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Burning Dog Face, and it's my pleasure to introduce you to Ziggurat. This game came out in 2014, and it's a first person action packed roguelike. We've seen the setup, so I guess all I have to say is that uh, even though this is a side series, this is going to be a blind LP. I jumped in in order to get a reading on the framerate and audio levels, but other than that, everything we're about to see is new. I would say the very first area, but, you know, it's procedurally generated, so... That area will never come again. Uh, pretty much all I know so far is that you start off with two characters unlocked. Argo, who is the Mario of the lineup, and Karina, who has done her homework diligently. Whatever that means in these circumstances. Hmm, progression. Let's just start with Argo. Seems appropriate. You can, uh... Adjust... What the fuck am I talking about? There's an option menu. Fuck. There is a menu option for resetting your, uh, progress. If I could speak, I'd be fine. Ooh! That is different. Both of the other times I did this, it was, uh... Well, it was a weapon called the, uh... The Ice Soul, or something like that. Basis das. Yoink! The Undead Scepter. This is kind of sensitive. Might have to turn the mouse sensitivity down. I don't know how I didn't notice that before. This is your generic wand. It does wand stuff. Here's something I noticed. The purple mana seems to regenerate infinitely. Uh, the other thing I found used the second slot, and it was ice blue mana, and it did not. This does not also this also does not seem to be regenerating. Let's wait until we find something to test it out. You know what? Let's try this one after all. Oh, good skeletons. Fuck it. This is the undead staff, right? Uh -huh. Now we're talking. Damn it, I am not doing well. What did that? Oh, good. In front of you guys. Inexcusable. My health sucks. I've seen three kinds of enemies. There were those bird things with human noses for heads, or whatever that was meant to be. There were banshees that shoot projectile screams at you. And there were slime, just trying to slap you in melee. I am fast. Can't even get a good look at what I'm aiming at. Uh, uh. If I hit escape, is it pause? It does. I'm going to turn the mouse sensitivity down a bit. Okay, that seems much better. Ah! Okay, fuck these guys, really. No! Uh, 
Just throw fucking bullets at him. Fuck it. Yes, your fire can't travel out here. Your fucking swords can. Oh god, no! No! Fuck these guys. Man, I did better the first time. I triggered a trap. No, I don't actually know how you regenerate health in this game. That. Sitting there, I thought they were fighting each other, which would have been nice. Eat a dick! I can see the last few guys through the walls. That's neat. No! So it looks like in Tower of Guns, like in Tower of Guns, uh, pickups don't last forever. Are you health? No. Man, I don't want the ziggurat to eat my soul. I actually got this game for free uh, on... The good old game's uh, launcher program, GOG Galaxy. Well, that was a couple weeks ago, so I'm afraid you guys can't take advantage of it. I've actually been waiting to do this because, in my head, it didn't seem to make sense to do a first-person shooter experience while I was already doing a Let's Play of Quake 4. Hello, what are you? Portal key acquired. You can now summon the Guardian of this floor. I got far enough to see the Guardian, well, a Guardian once, but I didn't stick around because I didn't want to beat a boss. the opposite of what I wanted to find. Oh, God. They are actually like that. Yeah, it was a, a big skull named Lord Arthur, or Sir Arthur. Oh, it ate my face. I need that! Well, now what the fuck am I going to do? Jump cut. Well, it's not the most impressive run, but, you know, I am just getting started. Oh. Stay on normal for now. For the next run, I'll give Karina a try. Once I get a handle on the actual game itself. Another new thing. I wonder what the odds are that I ended up with the same thing twice then when I was doing my testing. Firestorm grenades. Now we're talking. 
By the way, I mentioned that, uh... That trap I triggered. I actually got an achievement for that. So I thought I'd save the footage and show you guys how that went down. Oh, goodness. Why do they have such big noses? Yeah, I know, I said test, I was still too focused on audio levels and such. Oh god, it's the nose gremlins! You assholes again! And you assholes again! Oh, for fuck's sake, they're gonna shoot through walls! Yeah, I didn't think that would work. I hate these guys! I wonder what that does. I can just hold it down. better that time. Oh, this looks like the boss room. Yeah. Can I crouch? I don't know. I'll have to check the thing next time. I don't think I can crouch. Interesting. I don't see what I'm picking up. I wasn't a very good apprentice, was I? I wonder if I know that guy. No, I guess, it, of course, this is a dead end. The boss room. Sorry, for some reason, I keep expecting it to be like, uh... Honestly, I don't remember what it was I was playing where it was like that, but you hold down tab and the thing just becomes an overlay and you can still keep moving around. Oh god, another one of these. By the way, uh, I don't actually know how to show my achievements in-game. Like, I can bring uh, this up, but... Doesn't seem to be a thing for that anywhere. Except for, like, the most recent one. Can I click on that? No. It's a trap. You've been ambushed into treasure room. Uh, yeah. Sorry. Come on, not monsters. Motherfucker! How do only 39% of, uh, players have that? Fire that right up his ass. Ooh, ooh! I know a health potion when I see one. Oh, 
Okay, so far that's a ratio of uh, two monster traps to zero actual treasures in the treasure room. Manchies! I just wanted to show off their uh, projectile, even though that wasn't, maybe wasn't the wisest thing. <gasps> Reach level two! Figure out achievement unlocked. Practical lessons, get your first level up. Ow! Uh, you. Uh, everything hitched up for a second. Choose wisely. Scholar. Knowledge give gems give you more experience. Staff scavenger. Increase your staff mana pool. Yeah, I saw a loading screen tip about that. It's, uh, the... There are four kinds of weapons. It's like, wands, spell books, staves, and alchemical weapons, I think it was. I don't know, I don't think that's the order either. Um, and you can only carry one of each at a time. Hmm. I think this is permanent. Like, I think that's how progression works in this game. I don't know that for sure. I know there is some form of progression. There's a shitload of these cards to unlock. I don't even have a staff weapon. Fuck it. More experience is always good. No, not Jerry. These are big books, I suddenly realize. Look, look how big they are compared to this man's body. When in doubt, shoot it with your... T oh. Oh, the doors are closing behind me. Oh, of course, because I get into the room and a monster's attack. It's a dead end. That's fine. That's okay. We'll just go this way. Fuck. No. No, I don't like that. Nope, fuck that. Just enough. Give me that, give me that. Hmm, hate this. Mmm, right in the face! Ow! Was dumb. Where's that flying asshole? Wow! These guys are worth a lot of experience. He's invisible! Another one. A wrecking ball. Regain health by breaking things. Or alchemy pouch. Increase your alchemy mana pool. Absolutely, fucking lootly I'm good at breaking things. I'm going to write it off to magic. Damn it. I really don't want to wreck some of these books. Hmm. So it makes sense that their uh, magic books would be spell-proof. You know, I don't tell Argo here, but I've always preferred when you cast spells with your hands than uh, when you use a wand. It's just, I don't know, to me it seems inherently cooler. Oh, you shit! Anything I can break in here? 
with these candles? I don't know if that happened or not. I don't have hit R. Nothing. You don't need to reload the wand. Hmm. Well, there's that. Let me take a quick peek down here. Why are you dead? Oh god! Sprint! Eat a dick. Get back here, you little shit. There. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Cast Ziggurat. I'm gonna decide if this is gonna be a regular thing yet or not. I'll see you next time when you continue to brave the, the the dangers of the Ziggurat. Then let's say that later.